Next, we're going to Sen 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 Tam City, which is the biggest mall in the world. Is that right, Nanako? Yes. Not just in the North Hemisphere, or it's the biggest one in the whole world. It says right here in the magazine, largest in the world, but it's not even in the top 10. I think number one's in Dubai, but no, the small is not the largest in the world. From in... According in 2019, so I don't know if there's been a bigger one built, but let's go have a look. I'm hoping I can find Maple Story things, just because it's a good memory of mine playing that game, and it's from Korea, so... Oh my god, it's huge. Jesus Christ, we came out of the station and already we're greeted with mall. The station is the mall. What is this unit? Lotte Trevi Plaza? Looks fancy. It looks like I'm in ancient Rome. What the hell? All right, we've, we've come outside of the mall because we accidentally ended up in like the, the super special branded section of the mall. And over there is Trump World. I don't know what that is. Yeah. Oh, that, that's probably it. Yeah, we gotta go in this building. This is Bloody huge. This is not biggest in the world. Yeah, it's that one. Oh my god. Also, we went into a nice perfume store and we saw a perfume that we liked and we were like, how much is this? And the woman was like, it's 50 milliliters. <laughs> and we're like, mm, how much how much does this cost? And then she showed us the price and we're like, oh no. <laughs> we felt so awkward being like that. How much money? <laughs> you can't go into a fancy store and ask that. Dang it. Man, over there they got like Prada branded ice cream. I don't know what that is, but I want I want that. I want to try that. I didn't know they made ice cream as well to stain the clothes. Oh my god, look at that. Look how many levels there are. Oh. <laughs> wow. I still want that ice cream though. Oh my god, my favorite brand of clothing. Conde Garçons. Wow, it's so cool. I've got that t-shirt. I've got that t-shirt. How much is it brand new? It's it's, it's Ichiman ni Senyen. It's it's hundred and twenty dollars. How much did I spend? Forty. Forty or thirty. Forty. Forty. Oh my God, I got a really good deal on that shirt. I got the same shirt. That one's really cool with a white heart. It's a little baby, baby-sized heart, pixel heart. It's so crazy expensive, but I, but I love it. I love the little the little emblems that they have on all the clothing striped one but I've, I've been able to find them secondhand in japan like way cheaper i would never ever buy one new unless i was stupid with my money i don't know nanako likes mani neko so we're gonna have a little look there find like a cool dress or a bag or something wow wow nanako's favorite style oh my god the gundam base the gundam base vincey boy would lose it oh my god and ryotaro would lose it too nanako's brother whoa Oh my god, too many models, too many Gundam. $200? They're all about, they're all about $200. Wow. What the heck is BBC Earth store? They sell clothes of BBC Earth? Okay. Oh my god, overrated but delicious. We've had it in um, Japan a couple times. Very expensive for fancy fast food style burger. And it looks like it's pretty expensive here too. Frank Burger was cheaper and looked just as good. <laughs> We're in a Fall Raven uh, Kunkin store. We love these bags. I'm, I'm actually wearing one right now. You can't see it quite exactly. Oh my God, hats. Very cool. This brand is from Sweden, I believe, um, but very, very popular in Japan and quite popular in um, Australia and New Zealand too. I was able to get mine, my very first bag shipped from Australia when I lived in New Zealand. Very cool, like outdoor supplies. Oh my god, a, a tent? Kind of got dropped a key ring or something? Uh oh. My god, Tesla shop. I don't know about buying a Tesla in Korea. What do they have? Ice cream as well here? They might have ice cream. Oh, they've got Prada ice cream now, they've got Tesla ice cream. What's, the, what's going on with the free ice cream in Korea, man? Too over, overwhelming. Biggest mall in the world. We're so tired walking around, but every every's like, look at that shop, look at that shop. I just want to get out. We can't find the station. We're getting out of here. We're gonna we're gonna walk around the perimeter of the building to try and find the train station. We can't find it. 
Okay, we somehow made it back to where we started. There was a door over there that said push, and I pushed it, and I was like, it says push, why won't it open? And then Nanako just pushed it. How? Why did I have no strength? <laughs> I don't think we want this train, but I'm, I'm seeing this Genshin poster, and I'm very, very excited. Um, we're in um, a supermarket, just like a nearby supermarket to our hotel. I've just spotted this, Reebok branded drink. What the heck is that? A lime fizzy water or just like grapefruit? It's got a Reebok tennis ball. I don't know what that is. I might try that. Um, I'm gonna get some water. Then the girl wants to get a minute made. Kitty in New Zealand. Please turn the Oh, 100%. Man, is that bok choy? This is kind of a small supermarket, but we found some pretty interesting stuff. Um, just getting a couple of drinks. I'm getting my Reebok drink. I don't know what the heck that is. Oh, those are some big watermelons. Oh my God. The 2,000 yen, $20. Nut mm. and pancake. The nut pancake? Oh, yeah. Or breakfast? Oh, uh, breakfast. Good idea, breakfast. We're gonna go and get um, Nutty Chicken, which is a famous chicken place, um, and then bring it back to the hotel, which is that way. We're taking this elevator downstairs. Oh, there's like all these little food booths where people are sitting around eating. But we're getting our takeaway chicken. We're gonna actually eat in the hotel room. <laughs> we're a bit too tired. And can't communicate in Korean, so it's a little bit awkward all the drunk people. Oh, oh my god, there's so many! So many crabs and shrimp in there, what the hell? What the hell? They're all sitting on top of each other. Wow. We found a Natty Chicken, which is here. Takeaway chicken shop. It's not so busy, but we'll get the takeaway chicken and it'll be all good. We had a frantic moment of almost ordering the wrong chicken and we went outside and pointed at what the correct chicken was and they were like, no, that's exactly what we're going to cook for you, so no problems. You know, we're waiting for our chicken. All the guys, oh no. Oh no, there's so many guys. Chicken. <laughs> no Korean izakayas for me. Here we go, we're back at our hotel. My legs feel like they're wobbling from like all of the walking we've done today. Wow, here's the chicken. We've got sticky chicken and um, just like normal fried chicken. Came with like a little bit of uh, pickled kimchi and a Coke. We didn't order that. That's really nice service. I can't wait to dig in and get those sticky fingers. And look, let's put the television on for Korean television. Maybe some kind of K-dramas on. Or is this a commercial for that brand of pen? Is it? Is it? Maybe not. Maybe not. I thought it was a commercial for that brand of pen. That would be cool. This would be an amazing commercial. Can we eat now? Yeah. Okay, good. Oh my God, it looks so good. Whoa, it looks amazing. But I can't do any filming while I'm eating it because I'm just gonna get sticky fingers. And I, aren't we Nanako? Oh, it's, I can't it. it's so juicy and good. Mmm. Very, very nice batter as well. Korean fried chicken is so good. I can't wait to try that one as well. But I'm gonna get sticky, sticky fingers and I want Nanako to eat as well. So please join me, Nanako. Oh my God. Co Korean fried chicken. Mm. We found a TV show with like some Australian guys who were like traveling around. Can you hear the Australian accent? They're traveling on Jeju, which is an island off of uh, Korea. And um, we're watching it while we eat. And the chicken's so good, but there's so much. I'm not hungry anymore, but I think, will we finish all of it, Nanako? What do you think? How many you still have? I've still got like five more pieces or something. Oh, something? oh okay. Well, we might finish it. We'll be very full though. But this whole time I thought he was from Australia. He's from New Zealand. He's Kiwi in Korea. Oh my God. Man, I got it wrong. Is this a weekly show where they like go to different parts of Korea? This Kiwi family? Oh, maybe not. They're going home. Man, he's got a Kiwi accent, yeah. It's too similar to the Aussie one. Maybe I'm losing touch.
What did you say? What did you say about this guy, Nanako? I don't know. Scary. Scary. He, he does. Face. He looks kind of weird. Like, is he Korean? Surgery face, said Nanako. We're enjoying watching all the commercials of Korean brands and, and global brands. We saw McDonald's, Chilsung. There's a com there's a commercial for this the chill song that we drank today at the burger shop, but we also saw a commercial for Sprite earlier, which looked almost exactly the same. Oh, I've seen this guy. This is like an app game. Is it from Korea or Japan? I don't know. I think it's from Korea. Cheesy. Oh, Domino's! The, no, there's no way the pizza actually looks like that. Domino's. It's, it's got a different jingle in Korea. Apple? iPad phone. Uh, Macintosh. What, what is it called nowadays? Whoa. Anyway, I should probably stop filming all these commercials. We're going to the Changyong Culture Village. Here we are. It's still raining now. Oh, they've got like a cool fish art. Please, please, I want some of your bread. We've got the Korean Coke. One of the dishes arrived. Do you think that's the Bippin Bar? How the heck do we eat that? Oh my god, here we go. Big piece of crab, big piece of meat. 